Hi, I'm Hannah Salito, skin healing expert, and today I'd like to look at soda drinks and the impact that fizzy beverages can have on our body. Let's take cola for example. What happens when we drink a glass of cola? Well, after 20 minutes, we experience this dramatic insulin spike. This is because of all the sugar in the drink and our liver goes into overdrive. It's trying to process the sugar and it converts it into fat. In addition, after 40 minutes, the caffeine begins to kick in. Our pupils start to dilate and we experience an increase in blood pressure. We also experience this burst of dopamine. This is a neurotransmitter at the center of our brain and that creates a pleasure and reward cycle. And this is why cola or fizzy drink addiction is real. I used to feel like I was physically addicted to drinking Diet Coke. This was my hangover cure, my thirst quencher. It was my caffeine boost to start the day and I found it incredibly difficult to come away from this fizzy drink. But the connection there is real. Of course, all we're craving is that next dopamine hit. In addition to this, cola and other soda drinks are incredibly acidic. Now, this is also a problem. So we've got the acidity going on, the phosphoric acid that's in the drink, which begins to deplete the body of calcium. And you've also got that carbonation process. This too draws calcium away from the bones because calcium is our body's natural antacid. So it's trying to combat the acidic process that's created when we're consuming this soda drink. And so when people ask me about transitioning to a plant-based diet and they have concerns about not getting enough calcium in their diet, it's not excluding dairy that we should worry about. It's drinking soda drinks that can more readily deplete the body of its natural calcium source. Soda drinks are also incredibly acidic. So if we're talking about battery acid, that's a pH of one. Fresh natural water is a pH of around seven. Some cola drinks are said to be as low as 2.5. That is so close to battery acid. And as a child, you might have done that trick where you put a coin or a piece of dirty jewelry in a glass of cola, left it overnight, and in the morning it's sparkling clean. This stuff is incredibly powerful because it's literally eating away at the dirt. Imagine what that's doing to our insides. We should also look at some of the other ingredients in a can of cola, caramel color. Now, this sounds relatively harmless, but it actually contains a compound called 4-MEI, which has been proven by scientists to be carcinogenic. And in some states, such as California, the levels of 4-MEI are limited to just four milligrams, but in other parts of the world, it can be as high as 250 milligrams. Scientists at the University of California recently looked at soda drinks and the dramatic impact they can have on our skin. And there is most definitely a correlation. It can lead to premature aging and even a shortening of life in some cases. So it shouldn't be taken lightly. And if you do feel like you're addicted to these fizzy drinks, how do you begin to break that craving? Well, enjoying a natural fruit juice with no further added sugar topped up with sparkling water can be a really good way of making that transition. Essentially, it's pure still mineral water that we should be aiming for, but anything to make your life easier whilst you're trying to come off soda drinks.